So you remember that time we went to the wa Nanjing Water Cube? Yeah. Um, we were like all the classmates like from different batches, right? So we took like two buses to to go and splash in the water. We had fun all day. Uh, the first year uh, dance competition, we practiced for an entire month every day for that one minute and it came out perfectly. I had a chance to be in sport teams like basketball and football. Winning a scholarship award in the first year and would also be a really well planned and uh, funny April Fool's Day plan. I think it has to be uh, my first fashion show that I did here. Jangan used to ask me to go onto the board every day and write each and every Chinese word. And second thing is like when I go with Jeremy to any Chinese restaurant, he looks like Chinese guy, right? So people will ask him like, oh, Jian Chan, Niao Shaba, and I will be laughing so much. Living in the dorm. And MU 80th anniversary. I think it's great Chinese. Uh, the most uh, memorable moment to me personally is uh, my Jangan love show. Uh, asked me to sing a Chinese song for him. Weird, but then it was good. So what about you, John? The most, I think, a memorable moment for me was like when I went to the Chinese restaurant and I started eating with my hands. Then I realized, oh, I'm in China, I have to use the chopsticks. Sport meeting. The scholarship ceremony and the dance competition. And how old were you, sir? Uh, when I came to China to achieve my goal. It should be the time when we went to Purple Mountain, mm -hmm. especially when we went there in the night. Mm -hmm. It was fun, actually. My first year was really awesome because I made a lot of friends. I had to make a new friends and the culture was really good. Dancing with Hussein, rehearsing after classes and most of it winning it every time. And not to forget my first snowfall experience. Stone Park, first time I was danced there with my friends. I, it was very amazing and it's unforgettable moment for me. A culture festival. It has to be the very first day when I actually came to this university. I remember it being very late in the night but still being super excited to go to the class. And yeah, I finally got a Chinese name. Mm, I think for me, it must be whenever we, we used to have volleyball competitions. And then we had to play against Chinese teams. Mm -hmm. And we, it was very stressful, but we always tried our best to make a Sai win all the time. Today! My favorite food in Nanjing is uh, Mapo Tofu. I'm in love with Haitian or Huahua. Pomenji and Koro fan. Hai Rai Long Sia. Mala Tang and uh, Pudding Chocolate. Pomenji. What else? Long Sia. Chidan Ping and Chiro Tudu Kai Chia Fan. An Chun Ji. Chiro Ge Chia Fan. My favorite food is Pomenji and my favorite word is Pomenji. Probably miss many things, but the most important one is the freedom of going out any time, anywhere we want. Why Syria? Winter! Why wine? Alpha. I have a good friend and they're kind of convenient. I can order Taobao or wine anytime. That's what I like the most. Doing hysteroscopy with my teacher. She is uh, very kind and she let the male nice, nice. to check the gynecology <laughs> exam and everything. Assistant surgery. Uh, 24 is night shift. I was doing my surgery rotation and I was with Dr. Barry and I have assisting him for uh, anorectal resection for rectal cancer. Um, sixth year and because it's a great opportunity to assist with great surgeons and to learn more about the medicine. The first time I came to NMU, it was a sunny day, it was all beautiful, the scenery was nice, it was green. It was very difficult at the beginning to cope up with the environment, the culture and all. Oh, that was like, uh, this place is huge and I'm going to definitely get close around here. After looking everyone here in uh, new people in uh, many different countries, so it's very new to me. But after that, slowly, slowly, I have appreciated to the food, people, environment, and now what I want to do. Next question is like, I'm Thai, so Chinese art. Yeah, I'm already went to Thailand, so like 
strategy and answer me is like Thai food is really delicious and then sometimes it's like ask me for the WeChat ID Why do I look like Chinese people? Whenever I go out, Chinese people ask me like Don't you feel hot when you wear this? You are not a Chinese man? Well, everyone always asks me where I'm from because I love Chinese and my Chinese is pretty good Hi, all graduates of the SIE, especially an MBBS student. Congratulations for your convention and study. I still remember many years ago, especially an MBBS, when I first take over the work from Eric Thompson, I find you are so great. You give me a lot of feelings to think about, and uh, time flies. Six years passed, and you ago, I still have my complicated emotions with you. Today is your graduation, so I want to give all my best wishes and congratulations. I wish everyone a good future, bright future, overall to become a good doctor. Nanjing Medical University is proud of you. It's honored to have you. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> well, I would like to thank you for your efforts and take care of us from first year. It's my honor to be with you. So it has been six wonderful years. We are finally doctors. We would like to thank everyone who's been with us on this amazing journey. Our classmates and our teachers, the SIE, the Dean and the Vice Deans. And especially, Austin Lausche! Guys, we made it. Finally, here we are. After long six years. And this is not the end. It's the beginning of our long journey. We would like to say thank you to all our doctors, teachers and also classmates who help us to be who we are. We couldn't make it without your help. I wish you success in all your future endeavors and I wish you excel in whichever paths you wish to follow. I would like to thank you to Austin as he has been helping us all along since first year, not only inside the university but also outside. To me, Austin is not just a teacher, he's like one of my family members and he teaches his students like he teaches his own children. And I want to thank you him so much since the first year till now and to me. He is unforgettable. Thank you, Thank you, Thank you, Thank you. Thank you. Hi, I'm Wendy. And I'm Cassandra. And finally, we are done with medical school. It's been six long years and finally it's come to an end. We would like to say a very special thank you to NME for creating a very conducive environment for us to study. Beginning from the administration to the teachers and everyone. And to Austin. And Eric Lauschi. You guys did an amazing job. And finally to our classmates. We love you. Bye. Bye.